It is super hot out here today and I'm wearing this and some camo simply because I was out doing wildlife photography. Almost got the shot of the fox I've wanted to get for years. Didn't quite work. I'll keep trying. Today I'm out working the old river channel because I'm an idiot and not staying cool in the actual river. But I'm not an idiot because there's great gold in that hole. This is the results from my first 10 pans this morning. And I think that's pretty good. Most of these pieces are coarse and some of them even have some shape. And you know you've been mining when you find a shoot gun pellet. But you know what? The best thing I found today, the best thing I found was with the Macro Gold Cruiser. I pulled out an old pocket knife. That is a super cool find. Check that out. This old riverbed is actually a diversion trench created back in the 1880s by the old timers to divert water away from the original riverbed so they could access the pay gravels in the deeper holes. When they diverted it, they also diverted a lot of gold. I actually found a nail detecting him behind this rock and that's what started me digging here. So that's bedrock there. And this piece of bedrock here um, is sort of the same level and then it dips down. Now all of this is bedrock and we've got gravel sitting on top of it. So I've just dug down and I found a nice little depression and we're gonna pan this off. Now I don't think there's gonna be too much in this one because I found that all this overburden doesn't really have much in it. It's all in the bedrock. So this is just from that loose stuff on top. We've got two nice little flakes there, but the gold on the bedrock is a lot better. So let's get down a little deeper, see if we can't find that silty clay layer that I was working earlier. And I'll show you a really good pan. Yeah. yeah. This pan has far more bedrock in it, which is good. It's fracturing and usually those fractures hold gold. So hopefully, be a better pan but we're averaging probably 10 nice specks of pan when we get a good one off the bottom well there we go that's a much better pan. Have a look at this. Soon as you get into the bedrock, you start finding very, very nice pieces of gold and quite a lot of them. That's all I've really got to show you guys today. I just wanted to give you a little bit of an inside view as to what I do when I'm out prospecting, when I'm just looking for where the gold is depositing. And now I'm starting to find deposits everywhere in this old river channel. It's super exciting. I reckon we're gonna have some pretty good cleanups when we bring the high bankers back here. What are you doing, Ferdy Go?